Hey guys, in this video, we'll be showing you how you can make your own Fly Me account. Just like Me account in uh, Xiaomi phones, you can also create a Fly Me account in the Fly Me OS and basically does the same thing at, uh, as the Me account. You can basically back up your stuff, you can sync your stuff and you can also restore uh, your data. So basically, if you write a lot of notes, uh, the main usage for me of creating this account is basically uh, writing notes. I, I use this memos app a lot. So uh, suppose I write a lot of notes and after that I uh, mistakenly reset my phone or I basically lost my phone. Now what will I do? Uh, I, I lose all my notes. But when if you create a FlyMe account, if you create a new FlyMe account or log into uh, uh, the FlyMe account that you are using, uh, log into any FlyMe account on the device that you are using, you won't lose any of these notes. So the notes will get backed up uh, into the FlyMe account. So let me just show you how you can make your own FlyMe account. So first go into settings, uh, then swipe right and you will see this accounts. Tap on accounts and you will see this FlyMe. Uh, now just hit on register. And now you can enter your FlyMe account name over here. Then you can enter your password. Name has to be, uh, it's not an email ID, it's just a username kind of thing. So uh, just enter any username that's available. Uh, it will tell you if it's available or not. And then enter a password. It should be 8 to 16 digit uh, combination. And then enter any security email. Security email means like you can enter any of your current email address that you have, like of Gmail, Yahoo, uh, etc. Any email address that you have. But make sure you enter a security email that you use because uh, they will send you a confirmation uh, email uh, which you have to with a link which you have to click. And after only after that the account will be confirmed. So make sure you enter the correct security email. After you've done so, just hit on register and it will basically make your account. And after you hit on register, uh, the security email that you have entered will get an email uh, from them. And in that email, you'll see a, a, a confirmation link and you have to click that confirmation link to in order to confirm your account. As I've already have an account in FlyMe, I'll just go back and I'll just log into my account. Let me just quickly log into my account. So my FlyMe account name is Devansh. That is uh, my own name. I got that name. I don't know how, but no one registered. So I got it. <laughs> that's that's pretty nice. Uh, so the password I won't show you definitely. Let me just uh, pull my device back and enter the password. So uh, there you go. And I'll just log in right now. So yeah, I've just logged into my FlyMe account and complete. So as you can see, uh, now the FlyMe account has been set up and you can also set your own nickname. It's currently in Chinese. I'll just uh, keep it default. And then you have the data and sync options. Uh, so you can auto sync. You can sync over Wi-Fi only. I guess this one is better. So I'll turn it on. Uh, you can sync your contacts. Yes. Notes. Yes. Calendars. Yes. You can also sync your messages and call logs. Uh, input method. Browser history and stuff. Uh, blacklist. And you can sync some other settings like Wi-Fi, VPN and email account. So that's pretty helpful. If even like even if you lose your device, you'll have these data backed up so whenever you buy a new uh, FlyMe OS device you, your your data will be there so most of the data the important stuff will be there so that's how you basically make a new account in FlyMe OS uh, I hope you found it helpful and thanks for watching and please do hit the like button if you like this video if you disliked it if you didn't like it please comment down below or uh, you can fill up a form, I'll leave the link in the description why you disliked it and I'll make sure that I improve myself. So thanks for watching and peace.